Well, I am uh, Robert F. Smith. <laughs> Thank you. I, I don't think I could have a better person introduce me than Asunda. You are the best, and I admire all that you do, uh, not only at TIAA, but uh, in your life. And I love the way that you bring your full self to everything that you do, including introductions. So thank you again. Uh, I, I do feel quite honored to be part of this class. Um, when I see Julie, when I see Jenny, when I see Nitesh, and when I see Hamid, who I've just met, I think, two years ago. Uh, Hamdi, what, what we were doing there with the uh, RFK Human Rights and the work that you do, uh, I feel so privileged to be a part of this group. And Raj, of course, uh, who has become a recent friend, and delighted to see you honored as well for your work. It's critically important that we as business executives understand what we can do. We have the ability through our platforms to change lives, to open apertures, to create on-ramps of opportunity, to educate, to inform, and to inspire not only the youth of America, but the youth of the world. Many of our businesses are global in nature. Our platforms have far-reaching capabilities. And it's important that we embrace that opportunity to leverage these platforms, to inform the world that we as business people have the ability to change not only the economic environment that we are in, but the social environment in which we operate. I tell my teams all the time, part of our role is to impact the communities that we care about. Some of our communities are communities of employees. We have to give them the opportunities to excel, to be themselves, to bring their best selves every day to work, and to express that through their creativity, through their diligence, through their passion. But then the virtuous cycle of business, if we do this well, yields profits. We can then deliver those profits back to our shareholders. We can deliver those profits back to our employees, who can then plow them back into the communities that they care about. And it might be the foster kids that they grew up around. It might be students that they had a chance to go to school with in the past that didn't have the same resources and opportunities. It might be children who need music in their lives to inspire their hearts to be greater and to be better. But understand, it's important that we create that virtuous cycle. Capitalism is the heart of that. Your efforts are what make that heart pump. And it's important that we never forget that and that we bring all that we can every day to the platforms that we have, frankly, the privilege and the honor to steward, in some cases for short periods of times, in some cases for longer. But in stewarding those platforms, let's not lose sight of our humanity. And let's not forego the responsibility that we all have to other human beings on this planet. I want to thank you all for this award. I feel quite honored and privileged to be here with this distinguished class. And many of you I see all the time. And some of you I want to see more. So thank you again. <laughs>